I've had one of them days where you spend a lot of time talking to people and a lot of things just start to click into place. So this morning, got Gradient Snap resubmitted to the Chrome store, just really forgotten that I needed to fix a really annoying bug and push that out. And then I spent the afternoon talking to people about Scrapesy. So I had a really good conversation with one company about how we can work together. And then the other conversations were with some prospective clients. So they were asking, can it do this? Can it do that? And the first one I was like, that's basically our core product. We can handle that. And then the other one I was like, I'd completely overlook that. And so when people talk about you need to speak to your customers, these are the kind of things that you're missing out is I've completely overlooked a really obvious feature. It's not going to take me long to build. And it's more important than actually what my core product is for them. So just go and talk to people. I know you're scared, but time to put your big boy pants on and just try and find them, try and talk to them. The worst that can happen is they're saying, not interested, thank you. And that's it. And then I've got everything working for the whole Cloudflare verified bot program. So I had some questions, questions, concerns around how I was going to host it. Because obviously scraping companies don't normally respect bots.txt and we are going to. So that obviously puts us at a disadvantage as around how we go for this benefits, this verified bot program, how we can move forward with that while still being a competitive product. So anyway, I got all this implemented. It took forever cloudflare if you're watching this like that documentation was painful i didn't get it chat gpt struggled with it cloud code struggled with it so but it has made me realize that more than ever i need to replace context 7 it's not doing the job for me anymore so i'm sure over the next couple of days i'm going to probably build out a really ugly version of it that works with cloud code and just see where we go from there with it